Honestly, I was shocked, amazed, and excited. Firefighter Isaac McLennan is also relieved. On Thursday, he and Portland Fire and Rescue learned that FEMA awarded them a $2.1 million SAFER grant. SAFER stands for Staffing for Adequate Fire and Emergency Response. The money will specifically go to Fire Station 23 near Southeast 13th and Powell. It closed completely in 2010, then reopened in 2017 with just a two-person crew for medical calls. This station has been without a four-person fire engine, and we've been fighting this for the past five years. He points to last October. That's when fire destroyed an abandoned building and damaged two homes. Fire Station 23 is just a mile away, but their two-person team couldn't respond. The grant will fully staff Station 23 for three years. That helps coming, it's going to be coming faster, and they're going to get the right resource there in, in a quicker amount of time. McLennan, who's also president of the Portland Firefighters Association, says this reason to celebrate is dampened by another problem. We are in a staffing crisis. McLennan says they're down 29 frontline firefighters from being fully staffed. He says vacation and sick time mean some days there aren't enough crews to cover every spot. As a temporary fix, city leaders and the firefighters union agreed to a mandatory overtime solution. But that went on for longer than two years. McLennan says it's no longer sustainable, and starting this week, the union is no longer bound to that agreement. You know, with firefighters being forced to work, uh, it really, really has uh, it, it's devastated our morale. And it's also, it's also we're, we're concerned about the safety concerns of forcing people to work. And then there's this. To compensate for staffing shortages, the city has been temporarily grounding resources at two southeast Portland fire stations, Lentz and Montevilla. McLennan says they get the most 911 calls in the city. Each have a two-person rescue rig and a four-person fire engine. On lean days, the city is choosing not to staff the two-person rescue rigs, leaving just the fire engine to respond to calls. McLennan says that, too, is not sustainable. Every time they, they close a, a fire rig, that means that those neighborhoods are less safe. And since late December, the Firefighters Union says the city has pulled staffing from the Lance and Montevilla fire stations 110 times. Portland Fire is actively recruiting firefighters, but they say it's a slow process. And besides the 29 that are down right now, many more will soon be eligible to retire. David. Catherine.